Hello everyone, this is not the Art Array. This is a new show entitled WTF. No, it doesn't stand for what it normally stands for. You see, as a writer, I spend a lot of time in my head, and as a result, I get a lot of really random, weird, and sometimes hilarious thoughts. Also, my wife, who ironically enough isn't a writer, says a lot of random things as well. Sometimes they're very cute, sometimes they're very strange. Also, just like everyone else, there are certain things that just freaking irritate me. So this is going to be a quick compilation of those three things. Something my wife said, thoughts that I have, and something that freaking irritates me. So, here we go. Alright, so a little while ago, my wife and I were sitting outside, and we hear this sound. It's kind of like a really quick, like, do 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 sound. So I was like, huh, that kind of sounds like a helicopter. My wife looks at me and says, I thought it sounded like a giant rabbit jerking off. The other day, I just had this really random thought. I was like, you know what? There are 7 billion people in this world, which means there has to be at least one person out there who hates pizza, but loves pizza bagel bites. And I get it. They taste different. They totally taste different. I get it. But for some reason, it sounds like it just shouldn't be a thing. Like, if someone were to say that to you, like, oh, I don't like pizza, but I love pizza bagel bites, you'd just be like... What? One thing that really irritates me is when I go to a food place and they get my order wrong. And it's not for the same reasons that most people don't like this. It's not like, oh my god, I'm so inconvenienced, or what, you can't get an order right? Oh, Like, it's nothing like that. I understand mistakes are made. I used to work in the food industry. I've made a few mistakes myself. I understand it happens. The reason why it irritates me is because once the mistake is made, I have one of two choices, both of which I don't really care for. Option one is I could just deal with it, which is what I normally do because I really don't like option two. And the only problem I have with that, it's not about being spoiled or getting exactly what I want. It's just a, it's a matter of principle. You know, I paid for something and when you pay for something, you want what you paid for. And if the order's wrong, you're not really getting that. So it does sort of irk me a little bit. But I usually do it because of option two. Option two is you take it back and have them correct the order, which sounds good at first until you take into consideration that the original order that was wrong is going to be thrown away because there's all these legal reasons and people being afraid of being sued. They can't give it to other customers. They can't give it to homeless people. And sure, there's some times where they'll let you keep the wrong order and give you the right order, but they usually don't want to make a habit of that because then everyone would just say their order is wrong in order to get free stuff. So 9.5 out of 10 times, that original order is just going to be thrown in the trash. And that just irritates the crap out of me, knowing that that food is just going to be wasted. You know, there's so many people around the world who are starving. So the idea of wasting food, uh, to me, that's worse than not getting what I paid for. So that's why I usually uh, just deal with it. And there you go. So join me next Saturday. I'll have a new video up. Will it be another art array? Will it be another WTF? Or will it be something completely new? Tune in to find out. Hey!